Hey guys, Technomentary here in the video for you guys. Today we're going to show you guys how to check if an iPad is iCloud or activation lock. If you have the iPad with you or if you don't, there's a way to do it. And in this video, we're going to show you guys both of the methods. Pretty straightforward and simple to do. But before we go ahead and get started, if you guys are new to our channel, we do a lot of tech news, reviews, and giveaways. So make sure to hit that like button and subscribe button to get these kind of tips on your feed. So let's go ahead and get started with the method. The first way to check any Apple device is iCloud Lock is simply going to settings. And then once you go into settings, you're gonna to wanna to locate the iCloud info. Once you go into iCloud, you'll notice that either there's an account there, if account is there, that device is unfortunately iCloud Lock and you'll need the password to sign out of it. But as you can see here, this device is iCloud free or there's no iCloud on it because you, you have to sign in. As you can see here, it's requiring us to sign in with the email and password, and it's good to go. And we can create a new one if you don't have it. But if you see an account right there, that means that device is right now iCloud Lock at the moment, unless someone signs in. So we're gonna go ahead and sign in and show you guys how that process works. So as you can see right now, you were not able to see, but we're just signing into an iCloud account just to show you guys what it would look like if there was an account there and how you would want the original owner to sign out of that iCloud account because it's very important if a device is iCloud or activation log because you will not be able to use it if you're looking to use it for yourself. And that's very much you know makes the device useless and we want to make sure that we know about this and then the next method after that we're going to show you guys is actually how to check it even if you didn't have the ipad and there's a way to do it using the serial number and a site as well there's multiple sites out there that allows us to do that and here as you can see we're still looking to sign in into this iCloud and as you can see here, if someone is signed in here, their account name here, it's gonna be here and you to sign out of it, it's pretty much they have to actually sign out here and if you have the person or someone that has their account in there, ask them that they sign out and to sign out, this is the part that's tricky. As you see here, if you're not signed out here, it's gonna say sign out and once you click on that sign out button, it's gonna tell you to delete it's a couple things. And, but lastly, it's gonna ask you to enter the password. That's where Apple security steps in, is that if an original person has their account signed in, they need their original, they need their password to sign out. So if you're buying this device or giving it to someone, make sure you're signed out of it because the other person will not be able to use that device without the password that's linked to that email here. And we're gonna show you guys the other way that we told you that if you didn't have this device, you can actually check if iCloud is on. Simply to do that, you're gonna to go to general and then go to about and ask that person, you know, if they, you don't have the device, is to give the, the serial number. Because this iPad doesn't have a IMEI number because it's a Wi-Fi only, we're gonna use the serial number to check if the iCloud is on. And if you had the cellular version of it, you could take the IME number and check it as well. So we're going to go ahead and copy that serial number. Or if you don't have the device for buying from someone, ask them to give you the serial number. Once they give it to you, there's multiple site that does it, that does what's known as iCloud check. So we're going to do is use this site called iFree iCloud, iFree iCloud site, which is a free site where, as you can see, it's a free Apple IMEI serial number check. And if we click on that, of course, you're welcome to use other sites. If you Google check iCloud account on iPad, you'll find multiple of these sites. And these sites give you a status if someone is logged in to an app to an iPad and as you can see, it's still loading, it's kind of slow here, but once you have that, as you see we're gonna enter the serial number or the IME number that you have. And to do that, we're gonna simply go ahead, we're gonna go ahead and paste that in here, or if you have it, just type it in. 
And after you have done that, we're gonna go ahead and hit that search icon, the gotchas here, we're gonna select the square for the bus, and then verify. And once you start verifying, you'll notice it's doing a check right now. And as you can see, it tells us the device information. And the thing we're gonna notice here is that we're gonna see it's an iPad mini, 32 gig. And then this is the part we're gonna see is that find my iPad. So that's what means by iCloud is on. And to show you guys this in real time is that you wanna go to settings. And once you're in settings, we're gonna go to iCloud here. And as you can see here in the iCloud, um, this one is on. So once this one refreshes, we're gonna be able to see that the iCloud here is gonna be on. So if we do another refresh here, And we're gonna do a free check. So this website is free to use. Of course, there's a little bit of time delay in terms of how real time you can get. So sometimes if someone signs out or or if you're verifying if someone has signed out, if they said they signed out right away, you might have to give it maybe five to 10 minutes because with these services, sometimes it's not as real time because these are free services. But for the most part, it's accurate but to really be for sure you do want to ask the original owner if they're not signed in to make sure they're signed out and that's one way of course the other way to check so hopefully this video was helpful if this video is helpful please make sure to hit that like button subscribe button thanks for watching guys see you guys next time